Eagles, and welcome to Eagle TV 2.0. I'm your host, Leah Sakakini. And I'm Matt Casey. We have an exciting show planned for you today, so let's stay tuned. Let's start our morning off with a few announcements. Seniors, don't miss out on March Kairos taking place on March 24th through the 27th. Registration is now open. You definitely don't want to miss out, Eagles. Attention students interested in running for ASB executive or junior class or senior class office elections. Please make sure to have all your completed packets turned into Mr. Barry. ASB executive officer packets are due February 19th and junior senior class officer packets are due March 17th. Well, that wraps it up for announcements. Please check your emails for more information on upcoming events. Hey, Leah, how was your weekend? It was pretty relaxing and good. I honestly didn't want it to end. Now to wake us up on this early morning, we have another amazing edition of Monday Morning Live with Elizabeth and Claire. Take it away. Welcome to this week's edition of Monday Morning Live, where we will be giving you all the ASB updates that you need for the week. I'm your ASB president, Claire Crafts. And I'm your ASB vice president, Elizabeth Bondi. Last time our show was for our freshmen, this week our show is for our seniors. Let's talk about grad night, shall we Claire? Absolutely. It's going to be a once-in-a-lifetime event for us. Let's take a sneak peek at the night. Up on May 29th, please do not miss out. You heard the special announcement uh, not too long ago, going to California Adventure. It's going to be a night you're not going to want to miss. Tickets are still on sale. We do have to, you know, of course, let Disney know at a certain time uh, how many are coming, so do not wait on that. Get your grad night tickets now. I absolutely cannot wait to go to House of Blues in California Adventure. To guarantee your spot, you must purchase your, your grad night ticket before 3 p.m. on February 28th. Tickets sold after 3 p.m. on February 28th are not guaranteed and will be subject to remaining availability. This is a very special year. This is the first time SM has ever done this type of event for grad night, so you definitely don't want to miss out by buying your tickets late. Absolutely. I wish we could fast forward to May 30th Senioritis is hitting kind of hard, but it's okay. We'll make it till then. <laughs> that wraps it up. As always, ASB, ASB loves, loves you. Matt, are you going to grad night? I am going to grad night. It looks really fun. Yeah, I'm so excited. Thanks, Claire and Elizabeth, for always keeping us updated on all the ASB updates and happenings. Definitely. School can get a little busy and things can get a little hectic on the daily basis. Agreed. Now, let's start this Monday morning and let's tune into this week's edition of Mental Health Mondays with all the tips to keep us informed about mental health. Today's episode of Mental Health Awareness Mondays focuses on easy and free apps that help with mental health. The first app, Not Okay, gives you the ability to get immediate support from your friends and family or your peer network. It was created by a girl named Hannah who developed anxiety and deep depression after being terrified of being alone. The app Not Okay was born through the idea of having a button to press and for someone to know immediately that she was not okay. Her younger brother, Wire, framed the app for his sister and helps with the tech side. This app gives your trusted contacts messages when you are not okay and need help. The next app is called MindShift. This app helps you to check in with yourself and log any signs of anxiety, and it gives you different methods if you need help fast. Along with this, they have guided meditations. The next app is called eMoods. This helps you track your mood. It helps with other symptoms related to bipolar disorder, depression, PTSD, anxiety disorders, and they also provide a mood and symptom diary and reports that are all free to use. The last app is called Reach Out. This helps you to check in with how your anxiety is doing and it gives you toolkits and breathing exercises. Thank you for tuning into this week's Mental Health Awareness Mondays. Have a great week, SM. I know, I'll definitely keep that interesting information in mind. Switching gears, last week we had some special visitors on campus from Anaheim Ducks Catholic Night. Let's check it out. Wow, those games look like a lot of fun. Make sure to grab your tickets on anaheimducks.com slash catholic night. Yes, and remember the first thousand discounted tickets sold include a limited edition hat, post-game on-ice experience, a slap shot skill contest, and more. 
you definitely don't want to miss out. Now in club news, the Boxes of Love Club is holding a drive for Casa Teresa. Let's check out what Casa Teresa is all about and how you can support the drive. Um, I'm Andrea Smith and I am the president of the Boxes of Love Club at our school. So today I'm going to be talking to you about the charity drive that is coming up this week. Our charity drive is for Casa Teresa and Casa Teresa is a homeless shelter for women in crisis. Their mission is to help begin their healing journey through love, compassion, and empowerment. Many of these women have endured chronic homelessness, sexual abuse, and other intensive issues. Casa Teresa provides, along with a loving home, vocational and educational classes for these women to help them start a new life and get them back off their feet. The charity drive will be this week, and the collection bins will be in your religion classrooms. The stuff collected for it will be based off of grade level. Freshmen will be in charge of bringing baby clothes for zero to three months old and hairbrushes. Sophomores will be in charge of bringing body lotion and body wash. Juniors will be in charge of bringing baby diapers and journals. And finally, seniors will be in charge of bringing baby lotion and planners. As you can see, this is a really great cause and an amazing way to give back to the community. So please remember to donate this week. Thank you, and back to the host in the studio. Casa Teresa is definitely a great cause, so please make sure to turn your donations so we can help these mothers in need. I completely agree. Now let's wish a very happy birthday to Savannah Jimenez, Jacqueline Todd, and Angelina Moschetti. And a very happy birthday to Miss Barth and Coach Bell. Well, that's all we have for you today, Eagles. This has been Eagle TV 2.0. I'm Leah Sakakini. And I'm Matt Casey. Have a fantastic Monday morning, Eagles.